Hello, I'm Steve G. Jones, clinical hypnotherapist. When listening to this recording, be sure to only listen to it at night when you are safe and no one and nothing will disturb you. At the end of this recording, you will be given suggestions to fall into a restful sleep. If you are under a doctor's care, you should always consult your physician before using this recording. Never play this recording in a moving vehicle. Thank you and enjoy. Go ahead and get comfortable where you are sitting or lying. You are going to take five deep breaths. Each deep breath is going to relax you. All right, now inhale and focus on the consistent rise of your chest. Hold and slowly let it out. Just easily and effortlessly let it out. Let the air out. Breathing in once again, filling your lungs. Excellent. Hold. And release slowly. And three more times. Breathing in. Deep breath. Now hold. And... Let all of the air out very slowly. Good. Breathing in again, expanding your lungs. Good deep breath. Hold it. Open your mouth slightly and exhale very slowly. One more deep breath. Inhaling very slowly and deeply. Filling your lungs. And that's right. And hold it. Open your mouth slightly and exhale very slowly, feeling yourself relaxing as you exhale. And then continue breathing easily, effortlessly and comfortably. Good. I'd like you now to imagine yourself on a balcony in a large city. This balcony overlooks a beautiful park. The railing is sturdy. You are safe and relaxed. And you are standing on this balcony people watching. It can be so fascinating to watch people. You lean against the railing on the balcony and you run your hand along it. You see and feel that it is very strong and sturdy there is a street below you with sidewalks on either side. There are a lot of cars in the street. Most of them are taxis. You can see yellow car after yellow car below. Some have their lights on, on the roof, and some do not. There are a lot of people walking on the sidewalks below. You see a businessman in a suit with a briefcase in hand. You see a woman dressed for work also and she is talking on a cell phone. You see a mother walking two small children to school. 
You see students with backpacks walking to class. Since you are right next to the park, you also notice many people with their dogs walking in the park. You see two dog owners cross paths on the street below and you hear the dogs barking at each other as the people continue walking down the street. You hear other dogs barking in the park. And this is relaxing to you. They are enjoying themselves, enjoying their time in the park. You enjoy seeing people take time out of their day to walk their dogs. It is a very nice day outside. The sky is blue. The sun is shining. And you go back to watching people on the street. You wonder where some of the people are going. You imagine some of them are going grocery shopping and running errands. Perhaps some are on their way to meet other people. You see some people with bags in their hands perhaps spending their day shopping. You see people with cameras taking pictures. You wonder if perhaps they are tourists. You enjoy trying to figure out where people are going. Just as you think you have figured it out, another person comes along and you try to figure out where they are going. You take a deep breath in and you smell the scent of hot dogs from a vendor below. You look at people as they stop to get lunch at the hot dog stand. You look at people as they stop to eat at the hot dog stand. And your attention turns back to the park. It is autumn and the trees in the park are turning brilliant shades of red, orange and yellow. You see a group of people in a field playing frisbee. You watch as the frisbee is thrown from someone's hand and glides low to the ground into another person's hand. You watch for a little while as the frisbee goes back and forth. This motion relaxes you. You decide to sit down on a lounge chair on the balcony. This chair has plush cushions for you to sit on. You put your head back and prop your feet up and close your eyes. All sounds and smells fade away now. Even that smell of the hot dogs just fades away. And you focus on relaxing your entire body. You allow all muscles from the top of your head all the way down to your toes to relax. You allow all the muscles to loosen and relax 
one muscle at a time in your body. You clear your mind of any thoughts. Just let them go as they arise. Imagine they are floating off into the sky. You have no need for them right now. You enjoy the sun's warm rays on your body as your body soaks them up on this cool autumn day. And there is a slight breeze that sweeps across your body, further relaxing you. And you let your head relax on the cushion. You allow your entire body to sink into the chair. Your arms rest by your sides and your legs and feet feel loose as you lie there enjoying time to yourself, continuing to relax. Allowing yourself to drift now into a daydream. That's right. And you imagine yourself down there among the people just walking and relaxing, walking in the park, smelling the relaxing scent of the trees, hearing the grass beneath your feet, hearing the leaves crunch as you walk over them. Looking up at the trees and seeing the beautiful colors of the leaves. That's right. Such a relaxing time of year, such a relaxing place to be. And you imagine yourself walking on the sidewalk now. Feel the firm surface beneath your feet, supporting your every step. It is so peaceful walking on the sidewalk, enjoying this beautiful day in the city, seeing the people watching them do the things they do and go to the places they go. You enjoy people watching and you enjoy the atmosphere of this beautiful, peaceful city on this beautiful, wonderful day. As you now imagine yourself walking in the field That's right, the field you are watching from the balcony. You imagine walking in it now in your daydream, walking in it and relaxing. And you look back up to the balcony in your daydream. It's so peaceful to be imagining yourself walking and relaxing, breathing in the air, the perfect air with all those relaxing scents. It is so peaceful to be here right now for you to imagine yourself being here in your mind. 
and this helps you relax your body, your mind, and your spirit completely as you now continue relaxing deeper in your own way. Relaxing, unwinding, being calm, and letting go. And as you relax on the balcony, you very slowly stand up and walk back inside. So relaxed, so at ease. And you walk very slowly all the way out to the hallway. That's right. And when you reach the hallway, you very slowly walk down the hallway to the elevator. You are on the 10th floor. And you press the button to call the elevator. And when it arrives, the door opens slowly. And you walk inside the elevator. and the doors close behind you. And you are so very relaxed. And you press the button that takes you to the ground level. And you very slowly begin to descend to my count. For each number I count, you will travel one more floor down, starting with 10. So that by the time I reach the number one, you will have arrived at the ground floor and you will be completely relaxed. Because the lower I count, the lower the elevator goes. And the lower the elevator goes, the more you relax. Nine. Down another level. Relaxing a little more deeply as you very slowly travel down, 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 relaxing more and more. Eight, down, down, deeper and deeper as the elevator goes lower and lower. You are safe, relaxed, and protected in this elevator. Just enjoying the ride, enjoying this beautiful elevator, enjoying this time that you have to be alone and safe. 
and to think about how wonderful and powerful and amazing you are. Seven, down a little lower now as you relax a little more deeply. Down, down, deeper and deeper as the elevator goes a little lower now and you relax a little more. You are so very relaxed now in your elevator going down and relaxing more and more with each number I count. Six, down another floor, relaxing even more thoroughly now. Feel every part of your body, mind, and spirit completely at ease as you continue traveling down, down, down. Five, halfway there now and so much more relaxed than you were just a few moments ago. Realize how relaxed you are now. Realize how calm and peaceful you are now. Realize how calm you will be from now on in every situation as you learn how to relax yourself, to center yourself, to focus your mind. Four, down a little lower now, relaxing even more as you enjoy this peaceful ride in the elevator. Three, down another level and relaxing a little more deeply now. Two, so very, very relaxed. It is so peaceful to be right here, right now, in this relaxing elevator an elevator designed to relax your body, your mind, and your soul completely. So relax, and at the count of the next number, you will be completely relaxed and at ease, and you will have arrived on the ground floor, so peaceful, so happy, so very, very calm. All right now, one, you have arrived at the ground floor and the elevator door opens and you are so calm, so peaceful, so completely relaxed now. And as you continue relaxing deeper and deeper, I realize that there are certain memories you have, which at the time you went through them, or perhaps even good memories. But these memories at this time no longer serve you and need to be altered altered so that they are no longer detrimental to your life and the way you do things and your 
feelings of happiness. We are going to go through an exercise now, which is very powerful. It is going to scramble the memories that you have, which you no longer want to have, and make them ineffective, make them powerless. We are going to permanently alter those memories. Those memories, at the time they were encoded in your subconscious mind, were encoded with your emotional state at the time. That is why they now carry an emotional charge. We are going to remove the emotional charge from those memories by changing the association you have emotionally to those memories. In order to do this, I am going to use several techniques. One of them will be the introduction of humor. The other will be the introduction of elements which do not actually exist. But the introduction of these elements will cause the memories to be altered in such a way that they will no longer have any emotional charge which is detrimental to you. So I want you now to pick a memory that you have with someone, a memory you want to let go of. Imagine it now. And if you've listened to this recording several times, you realize that it becomes more and more difficult to remember certain things about that person. But pick a memory right now with that certain person. One memory with one person. Perhaps it was a good memory at the time, a time when you were happy with that person. And perhaps now that memory is no longer wanted. I want you now to imagine yourself watching television and I want you to see that memory on the television screen. See yourself interacting with that individual. And as you continue watching the screen, I want you to imagine your favorite cartoon character in the scene in the memory. It can be any cartoon character you choose. Just pick one now. Notice that your cartoon character is in that scene with the two of you. I want you now to imagine as you watch that television screen showing that memory that the person you are with is now turning into another cartoon character. So now you are with two cartoon characters, one which wasn't there before, and the person you are with has now turned into a cartoon character as well. I want you to notice how silly that person looks, the person you are with the cartoon character which has been introduced into the scene is laughing at that person. They are laughing at that person because they look very silly. The person you are with, who has now turned into a cartoon character, 
is very silly. Imagine them talking now, yet their voice is very funny. It almost doesn't sound human. I'd like you to imagine now that in your right hand is a can of spray paint. And I would like you to imagine spraying some spray paint onto the television screen so that it becomes difficult to see what is going on. All you know is that something very silly and ridiculous is happening. You have a vague glimpse of the scene. Now I want you to imagine yourself watching that memory as it actually occurred. However, the person you are with is now a silly cartoon character and there is a cartoon character in the scene also who is laughing at that person and you have sprayed some spray paint on the television screen as you are watching it, but continue watching the memory. And now I'd like you to imagine picking up a different color spray paint can and spraying the rest of the television screen with the spray paint so that you can no longer see the screen. You are aware that the scene is happening behind the spray paint, yet you cannot see the memory. The memory is blocked from your view. But the scene continues even though you can't see it. And you realize how ridiculous that scene was and you laugh to yourself at how silly it was, how ridiculous and silly it was. And I'd like you now to imagine a different scene with either that same person or a different person, a memory which you would like to get rid of. See the scene now, as it actually happened. See yourself with an individual. I want you to take a good look at that individual as you watch the memory on that television screen. The television screen is now clear again. The spray paint is gone and you are able to see the scene clearly. A different scene with either the same person or a different person, but it is a memory you are watching, a memory you would like to get rid of. As you look at the person you are with, I want you to notice how silly they look. Their eyes look very silly. The eyes are bulging out, just like in a cartoon. The eyes are very large and bulging out of their head. Their face is very large and disproportionate in relation to their body. Their body looks very silly to you now. Continue watching the scene and realizing how embarrassed you are to be with this person and you are happy that you're only watching the scene. I want you now to imagine that person looking unattractive. Notice certain features on their face as those features now become exaggerated to the point of looking grotesque and disgusting. 
you are thankful that you are only watching this memory of you with that person because that person is now very ugly to you. And see yourself as you watch that memory becoming embarrassed to be with that person. Listen to their voice now. It sounds like a cartoon character. It sounds very silly, very embarrassing. And I want you now to imagine taking that can of spray paint again, either can, and spraying the entire television screen with that can, covering it completely. Although that memory is still occurring on that television screen, you cannot see it. That memory has been distorted and is now blocked. Good. And now, as I am silent, I would like you to pick a few other memories and see them. On that television screen, one after the other. And imagine the person you are with being ugly or being a cartoon character and imagine yourself spraying that television screen with spray paint until you can't see them anymore. Choose several memories as I am silent. Realize that each time you listen to this recording, you can choose a new memory if you want to, or you can further distort a memory you have already worked with. But for right now, choose a few memories to work with and distort them as I am silent. Good. And as you continue relaxing deeper, deeper, and more deeply relaxed, you begin to realize just how powerful you are. Just how powerful your mind is. You have a very powerful mind. And I'd like you now to realize that you can erase any part of your mind, any part of your memory that you choose to erase. As you take control of your mind, erasing a certain part of your memory, 
This process allows you to feel empowered. I would like you now to imagine that your mind is a computer and you can see the contents of your mind displayed on a computer screen. You can easily do a search for the memories of particular people by typing in their name on the screen. When you do this, all of the memories concerning that person will appear on the screen. And if you erase all of those memories, you will see that fact displayed on the screen because those memories will no longer be displayed on the screen. The evidence of their removal will be clear to you. I would like you now to type in a name. Notice what appears on the screen. And I would like you now, in your mind, to realize that on this computer screen, each of these memories you are seeing has a little box next to it. And you now use the mouse and click on the boxes next to the memories you choose to erase. And as you click on those boxes, just relax and allow yourself to be thorough. Take time to do this thoroughly now, as I am silent. Good. And now, I would like you to click on the button that says Erase. And all of those memories you have chosen concerning that person are erased. If you have chosen to erase all of the memories, that's fine. If you have chosen to erase only some memories, that's fine. But the choice you have made is your choice. And when you now click on Erase, the memories you have chosen to erase are gone immediately. And now, if there is another name you would like to enter, a person about whom you would like to have memories erased, enter that name now.
And when you enter that name, the memories that you have concerning that person are displayed on the screen. Each memory has a little box next to it. As I am silent, take a few moments to put a check mark next to the ones you want to erase. Good. Now I want you to click the erase button and erase those memories you have chosen. Good. Now if there are any other people about whom you would like to erase memories from your mind, enter their names now. And as I am silent, you can go through the process of erasing the memories that you want to erase concerning each of these people. Do this process now as I am silent. Good. Now let those memories fade from your mind, fade away. And day by day, those memories will fade more and more. And as you go through this exercise by listening to this recording, you will become more skilled at erasing memories which you no longer want or need. And very soon indeed those memories will be permanently erased forever, allowing you to live a wonderful, exciting, empowered and happy life.
because those memories will be gone completely, allowing you the freedom to have joy in your life, to have power in your life, to have excitement in your life, to feel good about who you are, and to be open to another relationship if you choose that. And you realize that if you are open to a new relationship, you will no longer carry the baggage of the past. You have decided to let it go forever. So relax now and realize that the computer of your mind, the powerful computer of your mind, has been instructed to erase those memories that you no longer want or need. So relax and realize that this will happen easily and effortlessly because you are in charge of your mind and those memories you no longer want or need have been instructed to leave your memory forever. And as you continue relaxing deeper and deeper and more deeply relaxed, I would like you to imagine yourself six months from now, having completely forgotten about that person or those people you no longer want to remember. You have efficiently erased their memories from your mind. either in their entirety, or you have erased selected memories. But see yourself six months from now, happy, feeling good about yourself. Feel how good it feels to be you six months from now. That's right. See yourself smiling, joking, being happy, doing what you want to do. Imagine this now as I am silent. Good. And now I'd like you to imagine yourself one year from now. It has been a wonderful year. You have accomplished so much. If you have chosen to bring someone else into your life, 
you have done so without the baggage of the past. And you have created a wonderful relationship. If you have chosen to be by yourself, notice how good you feel about that, being by yourself, because you are a very powerful individual. You have developed your hobbies, your interests. You have pursued what makes you happy, what brings you joy and you are living the life of your dreams, fully engaged in life, happy, satisfied, moving forward, motivated. Imagine this now as I am silent. And you realize that you have the ability to forget anything you choose. And that power is becoming more and more real for you day by day. All you have to do is choose a person and go from there. Your mind knows the techniques to use. So relax and realize that everything is going to be just fine. And as you continue to relax, every breath you take is soothing, soothing you. Focus now on your breathing. I wonder how much attention you have paid to the many different thoughts floating through your mind. Your mind is so active even while it relaxes. And then you can become aware of how difficult it is to remember what I was talking about exactly seven minutes ago. And you can try to remember what I was saying nine minutes ago or what you were thinking four minutes ago. But doesn't it seem like too much work to try to remember all of that? It takes more effort than it's worth. So relax. Relax comfortably and understand that you don't have to remember what I was saying when it's too much work to do. You can choose to remember to forget what I said or to forget to remember what I said. The choice is yours.
if you should be listening to this recording at night, you will fall into a deep and very peaceful sleep. And while you are asleep and dreaming, understand that your subconscious mind will be processing every word I have said. And each time you hear these words, these suggestions become more and more powerful for you. Each and every time you listen to these words, these suggestions become more and more a part of your being. Each and every time you listen to this recording, you become more and more the person of your choosing, a relaxed, comfortable, confident person And that feels wonderful and when you awaken in the morning, you will be well rested, refreshed, revitalized and ready for a new day. And that feels wonderful.